what do you guys think about my hair just wanted to show you guys i recorded a whole video like a little hair tutorial on this entire hair thing i've never did it before but i was inspired by naturally sunny she did a flexi rod set on her hair and it looked really bomb so i tried it out i think it looks pretty cool it's very different for me but um i think i'll like it even more like as the days pass by so it'll get kind of bigger anyways me and my sister just got done recording um an episode of millennials voice podcast which you can click right here on the screen and check us out um you can listen to us or watch us or both but anyways, I'm about to actually go, I think, to Del Taco and get a taco salad because I'm really hungry. I was going to make a sandwich, but I don't feel like doing it. So I'm just going to get a little bite to eat real quick. Um, so yeah, I'm about to go get my food, edit this podcast, and I'll see you guys later. Hey guys, so it's much later. New Year's is coming up, like I said, um, in like two days. So I am actually going to be going to Atlanta. Um, I think I told y'all this already. I forgot, but I'm going up to Atlanta probably Thursday morning, which is New Year's Eve. I'm going to drive up there that morning. And I think we're going, sure, I know we're doing something, probably going out, whatever. But I want to go to a day party Jada is hosting. So I'm trying to find, I know we're going to go out and like go to, out to eat or whatever. So I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to wear. I have one outfit in mind, but I don't know because I don't know about the weather, my body. So I'm trying to piece some things together in my brain cells. So that's what I'm trying to do right now. Y'all are in my closet right now. Excuse all that. That's anyways. One outfit I know for sure. This, well, I'm gonna show y'all once I lay the outfits out. But yeah, this should be fun, hopefully. Yeah, I'm gonna be vlogging it all, of course, so you guys can enjoy it. And yeah. So I told y'all I was going to Atlanta for New Year's, so I had to go to Walmart to get a few travel things. Just some loofahs, some hairspray, these little travel floss sticks, which I love, some wipes, a little lotion, travel lotion, Tylenol, because I always get headaches, and then some more deodorant. Okay guys, so I've literally just spent like four hours doing a fitting. So I have all my outfits laid out. Um, here's an option for like the nighttime. This is a really cute outfit for the nighttime. This is like um, if we do brunch or whatever, this is really cute. Another like daytime or it could be nighttime if we go to a bar or something. And then this is really cute for like a really cute brunch. And then I have just my two bags I'm going to bring. And then those shades. I wanted to wear that hat, but I don't have an outfit for it. So yeah, now I'm about to put everything in this suitcase and go to bed. Tired. Hey guys, it is actually the new year. Happy New Year 2021. I hope it is just a great year full of... Um, just health, happiness, success, money, all that good stuff that everybody wants every year. But it's actually the new year. I told y'all I was going to be in Atlanta. Actually, I brought in the new year here in Columbus with um, my cousins and a few friends. But today is actually the first day of New Year's, um, January 1st. So today I'm driving to Atlanta. I'm going to spend the weekend up there. Today's Friday. It's raining. <sighs> So I've been had my bags packed and all that stuff. I just didn't go yesterday. I'm going to go today. But y'all, it's already 2.30. Um, Because I stayed out till 4 o'clock last night. So there was no way I was about to wake up early. I was actually kind of cute last night. Let me show y'all the little picture. 
Y'all see that? That's do I even look like the same person? Anyways, that was me. Pretty cute. Y'all follow me on Instagram at say.sophie. But yeah, I'm just gonna relay my hair because I did a ponytail, which I actually made a whole um two in one get ready with me. So you guys should check that out on my channel. Hey guys, so I just got done, you know washing my face and all that stuff. I've redid my hair, put my little ponytail back on. I bon Quisha. And I have my edges just laying, of course. And I have these little under eye, what are these, eye patches on? These are by Pixie. They're really, really, like, highly talked about. But by Pixie, they're the Beauty Fi. You get it? <laughs> Beautify Brightening Eye Patches. So that's what I have under my eyeballs right now. And my sister just brought me a salad, so I'm about to go downstairs and eat. Then after that, I'm going to probably head out. So I'll see you guys on the road again. <laughs> I am just here closing out this week's vlog today is Sunday and I'm just kind of like resetting so my week can be together so I'm just deep conditioning my hair cleaning up my room just you know things or whatever but I just kind of wanted to come on camera and express that uh, y'all I really don't feel like being stressed or bring I don't want to start this new year off crying about my life but I feel like it's coming, y'all. Yeah. So I was, or I work at Target, and but I was on a leave of absence for about a month. My manager told me, you know, let me know when, well, my leave of absence is up, but I can come back to work. So I said, okay, cool, put me on a schedule. Then she says, yeah, we'll add you to the schedule, but you'll probably only get about one shift a week because we have payroll cuts. What the heck? What am I going to do with one shift a week? I'm trying to get this, I really, really, really want to get, um, this at home job with Apple. That's what I really want to happen, but I don't know. But until then, I am pretty much unemployed at this point. And it's really stressful because I need money, but I don't really know what else to do. I guess that's enough of me complaining to you guys like you care. I don't want to be Debbie the Downer. I'm trying to be a little more positive and optimistic, but so far this year is <laughs> going great you know what i wish i had a rich family that's why sometimes i don't like getting on social media like instagram and stuff because which you know everything that glistens ain't gold and people only put up pictures we don't know what they're going through but sometimes i don't like getting on social media because like people are posting like their lives it seems to be so great and no worries about money or a job you just comp and i end up comparing myself and feeling like a loser I'm feeling like a broke betty which i am so but anyways thanks for watching this vlog guys and um i'll see you in my next video it's probably going to be a hair tutorial because i actually did a one hair soil and a two-in-one, whatever. Y'all will see it on my channel. Make sure you hit the subscribe button. Bye-bye.